Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we have an update of election map. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, share, and subscribe for more election videos. Our source today is the NewYorkTimes.com. Everyone loves the New York Times, don't they? All right, according to them, who's leading the polls? Harris, plus three in the national polls. And they also have statistics for the battlegrounds, which you can look at for yourselves and not call us biased. Let's fill in that map. We're going to reference this website every time we get to a battleground state. Washington State with 12 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Oregon with 8 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Hawaii with 4 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Alaska with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Montana with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Idaho with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wyoming with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Utah with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada with six electoral votes, according to the nytimes.com. Nevada has Harris at plus one, so that makes Nevada blue for Kamala Harris. Arizona with 11 electoral votes, according to nytimes.com. Let's see. Arizona has Trump at plus two, giving Arizona's electoral votes to Donald J. Trump. They are red. Colorado with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico with five electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. North Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. South Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nebraska is red at large for Donald J. Trump. The first district is red for Donald J. Trump, and the second district is blue for Kamala Harris. Kansas, with six electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Oklahoma, with seven electoral votes, is red for Donald J. Trump. Texas, with 40 electoral votes, is two clicks red for Donald J. Trump. Minnesota, with 10 electoral votes, is blue for Kamala Harris and Timothy Waltz. Uh, Wisconsin, according to nytimes.com, Wisconsin is Harris plus one. And Michigan is Harris plus one, making Wisconsin and Michigan both blue for Kamala Harris. Iowa with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Missouri with 10 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Arkansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Louisiana with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Illinois with 19 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Indiana with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Ohio with 17 electoral votes is Two clicks, red, for Donald J. Trump and J.D. Vance, the hillbilly eulogy. West Virginia with four electoral votes is red, for Donald J. Trump. Kentucky with eight electoral votes is red, for Donald J. Trump. Tennessee with 11 electoral votes is red, for Donald J. Trump. Mississippi with six electoral votes is red, for Donald J. Trump. Alabama with nine electoral votes is red, for Donald J. Trump. Florida with 30 electoral votes is two clicks, red, for Donald J. Trump. Georgia, according to the nytimes.com, Georgia is... Trump plus one, making Georgia red for Donald J. Trump. South Carolina with nine electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. North Carolina, according to the NY Times, North Carolina has Trump up by one, making North Carolina red for Donald J. Trump. Virginia with 13 electoral votes is light blue for Kamala Harris. Two clicks. Pennsylvania, whoo, Pennsylvania, according to the NY Times, this is going to be a kicker right here. Pennsylvania has Harris plus one, therefore giving their electoral votes blue for Kamala Harris in Pennsylvania. And Maine itself, ME at the top right, is blue. The second district, yeah, blue. And the rest of them are New Hampshire, Vermont, Connecticut, New Jersey, Delaware, Massachusetts, Rhode Island, Maryland, and D.C. are all blue for Kamala Harris. New York with 28 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. That gives Kamala Harris 277 electoral votes and Donald J. Trump 259, making Kamala Harris and Tim Walls your vice president and president-elect. What do you guys feel about this electoral map? Let us know in the comments below, as my wife said in the beginning. I'm President Ross. And I'm back. And we are out. burnt out.